Hello everyone, welcome back to the Foxtech YouTube channel. What I have for you right now is an iPad which is in front of me and this video is going to be about changing the email address associated with your Apple ID on your iPad. Now there may be two things which you may mean by this, so I'm going to cover both of them right now. The very first thing you may be referring to is how you can actually change the Apple ID email that you use. I mean, uh, well, if you know you have an Apple ID which you have to use to download apps and do basically anything on an iPad, if you want to switch to a different Apple ID, then this is what you have to do. You just have to open up the settings. Go to the iCloud section by clicking on your name at the top and scroll all the way to the bottom and hit sign out. When you do that, you're going to be presented with a section where you have to enter your password to know that you are legitimate. So you're going to turn it off. And after the entire process is done, you're going to be able to create a brand new or log in with a different Apple ID or even create a new one and that's how you can switch from one Apple ID email to another. So just sign out from iCloud then sign back in with a new Apple ID. But this is probably not something which you have expected. I mean perhaps yes but there is also a second scenario or a second thing you may be referring to. And the second thing is changing the actual email of your current Apple ID. So you're not switching to a different uh, Apple ID, you're just changing the email you use for your Apple ID. For this, you're gonna have to open up Safari and locate or go to the URL tab bar and type in appleid.apple.com. So you're gonna go like this, type it in very quickly and it's going to get you to a page where you can log in with your Apple ID. It doesn't matter if you are on your iPhone or iPad, you just get in here. You can sign in. It's going to let you probably use Face ID for that. So you can see I'm signing in and on this page on a Safari website, you're going to be able to change a bunch of different things. So you can see sign in and security and you can choose Apple ID. So you're going to click on it. And right now it's the way to change your Apple ID email address from the current one to a new one. So your Apple ID is used to access all Apple products and services. And here's a text field where you can type in your new Apple ID, enter a new email address to be uh, to use as your Apple ID. A verification code will be sent to this address you're going to type it in. And that's that means that everything stays as it is. All of the payment methods, everything that you have set up, it's just going to be there, but you're going to use a different email address to sign in. And if this is the thing that you wanted to achieve, then this is the only way how you can do it. It's a bit weird, to be honest, that you have to use it or do it through Safari and not in the settings, but that's just how it works. So I really hope that I explained to you how you can do it, how it works, and hopefully you now, you now know what you can do about it. Thanks a lot for watching. If you like the video, make sure to leave a thumbs up on it. Leave a comment saying something about the video or perhaps leave a question. Hit the thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. We can see each other later on in the future. Peace out till then.